Good morning. Another hail storm last night, but we got up a little extra early this morning. And mosquitoes are crazy, but hopefully by getting up earlier, we can get some more hiking in. The storm didn't come until five yesterday, which was nice because it was hailing at like two, two days before that. After I got in my tent last night, I realized almost everything I told you yesterday was wrong. The name of the pass, the name of the mountains. Hopefully you'll forgive me. I will correct it soon. So the name of the pass yesterday was Benson Pass. And going southbound on that would definitely be more difficult than being northbound. Although northbound, it was some steep downhill almost all day. Uh, today, we almost climbed Sevy Pass last night, but we got rained and hailed out. We scored this morning. Finally, the mosquitoes have stopped attacking, at least for the moment. Mosquitoes weren't so bad. This would be so much more beautiful. Literally have to keep moving. Or they will eat your face. Well, the mosquitoes are terrible. I don't know how, between the weather and the mosquitoes, anyone plans on doing 20s through this section unless they're half Ibex and they wake up at three o'clock in the morning. But beautiful. Got my knock. Up to my Sawyer, just filtering the water using gravity so I don't have to squeeze. Back in the forest of tall trees, still can't stop for very long or the mosquitoes will get you. But we started at 6 30 this morning instead of 8, and I can already tell. We're gonna have to start early in order to get out of here at a decent time, just with the weather and the condition of the trail. Um, the river crossings, one of the most dangerous river crossings there is. A friend of mine fell in last night. Thankfully he's okay, and even most of his gear stayed dry, so it shouldn't be that bad, but we gotta slow down and take our time over these things or we're gonna get hurt. Thought I smelled smoke coming down that first, no, second hill this morning and then turn around after this last creek crossing and I see this. It's not good. I don't know if it was caused by a storm or a person or what, but uh, I hope somebody sees that pretty quickly. Well, I was getting a little frustrated after that fire because I couldn't get cell phone service to call somebody about it. And the Garmin doesn't have a fire button, just an SOS button. So I thought when I got to the top of this next hill, I still didn't have service, I'd start firing off Garmin messages, see if somebody could contact the fire department on our behalf. But. A big, beautiful red helicopter just flew overhead, so I think they know about it. Our trail is being cut by these beautiful little green plants, and this is one of the beautiful lakes up in the mountains. But I don't think we're going to go swimming in it, just because 
don't want to deal with the mosquitoes. So I just stirred up a whole hive of mosquitoes and horse flies. Worst I've come across so far. Only I didn't even filter a whole liter of water, I just had to get out of there. And this lake is notorious for the bug problem, it's Wilma Lake.